Hello and welcome to Staff Timesheets from the CleanLink mobile app. This video tutorial will focus on what you need to do in Site Manager to prepare yourself for using Staff Timesheets from a mobile device. We will cover setting up timesheet parameters, sending timesheets to mobile devices and what your managers will see on their mobile devices. If you are hoping to see how to process timesheet data, please see our third and final film in this series. Before you can use timesheets in line with mobile devices, you will need to set up your chosen parameters in Site Manager. To do this, go to Setups, select number 11, Payroll Cycles. Select your cycle and press Details. Tick the Import Cycle Data field and then press the Import Details button. You now have some decisions to make. Minutes short and minutes extra are used to set what is classed as being within tolerance of an employee's regular pay. For example, I've entered 10 in each field. In this scenario, if the employee's regular hours are 2 and they work 1 hour 50 minutes or 2 hours and 10 minutes, they will still receive 2 hours pay. If they work only 1 hour and 49 minutes, then they will only be paid for 1 hour and 49 minutes. Choose whether to pay overtime and staff with no regular pay by ticking the relevant fields. You can also choose whether to post hours with an outstanding oddity, such as a comment on a timesheet. The overtime and non-regular pay paid in units of field should be set in minutes. For example, if this is set to 15 minutes, then anyone working less than 15 minutes extra will not be paid overtime. If they work between 15 and 29 minutes, they'll be paid 15 minutes, and so on. To send staff timesheets to the mobile devices, go to the Pay tab and select Option B. Ensure the correct cycle and period is selected and tick Mobile Output. If you wish, select which area to send to the mobile device before choosing which week of the period to send and press OK. Each week is sent separately, which is why you make a selection. For monthly cycles this can be between 1 and 6. For weekly cycles this is limited to the number of weeks in the cycle. Now let me show you what your managers will see on their mobile devices. Timesheets will arrive in the inbox when your manager syncs their device. This is where they will open it from to make amendments. You will notice the timesheet includes the dates covered in the week, as well as listing regular employees and their total regular hours. The actual figure will increase and decrease as hours are amended. When the manager selects an employee within the timesheet, you can see they are shown the regular hours for each pay rate, as well as the current holiday accrual figure. This screen is where the manager will make their amendments from. You can see in this final example that employee Simon Anderson has had amendments made to his hours as the actual figure is now different to the regular. The green circle indicates this employee's timesheet has been marked as complete. For more information on setting up Site Manager for use with timesheets on the CleanLink mobile app, See the help manual. Remember, you can access it at any time by pressing F1 within CleanLink. See you next time.